No more excuses, no more weather this, tires this. In a no passer, or 161 whipper. Top one, I ain't no capper. I'm a jammer, stick whips like Schumacher. But you know, man's got melanin, so they call my Michael Shoe Blacker. Might see him in the RS3, but the Evo's old school like Kappa. Your little remap don't matter. Mm. Pull up on the track, get splatter. Stay on the ball like Kaka Saka matter, so it don't matter. When I'm on form, man can't chat Maka. On job, I ain't never been a slacker. I ain't never been no side man. Still have the Evo side. You don't wanna pull up and try man, show man light where nigga that's lightweight. I do the dash, that's mine. Oh, one six one drive. Yes, people, Michael Shoeblacker. Listen, 10k subscribers, you know. Big up your chests, trust me. But yo, people, listen. We pulled her out of hibernation, haven't we? It's been a minute. It's been a minute. People are like, where's the RS3 gone? Have you sold it? Have you done this? Not to say that I've not made a decision on what I'm doing yet. But you know, it's been parked up. We've had the M3, we've had the GTI. But yo, I was missing my main squeeze, weren't I? You know what I'm saying? At, oh yeah, big up your respect. Big up the cameraman, you know the thing. But listen people, today we're at your respect, yeah? We're getting Sam out. You might recognize Sam from the, one of the previous episodes where he was, where he took this for a drive after the suspension secrets video. And then we had it with Darud in the Ferrari. We'll go back to that clip now. Go on, Sam, all on him, on him, on him, on him, on him, on him. Sam. Straight in, straight in, straight in. Come on, come on. Are you nuts? Yo, yes, Michael Shoe Yeah, boom. We're gonna get Sam out. Talk to Sam on the phone the other day. I was like, Sam, what are you saying? I was like, you've had this car parked up for a minute and he's still ain't pulling it out. It's time to get it on the channel. He's like, oh, you know, the weather. Oh, you know. I said, come, stop coming with any excuses, brother. Get the car out. Put her up against the main squeeze, yeah, the RS tree, you get me? And then we will really see how quick this car is. But I see it time and time and time again, people. This car duppies 90% of the things on the road. And I'm talking bodies done, you get me? Cremated a lot, ashes getting sprinkled. You get me, things are done. And I'm just burying man. Man, oh, bruh, you didn't tell me your thing was stay free. Do your research, bro. Do your research. You get me? Let's go back to one of our previous time. Man's had GTRs in this, R8s in this, 458, 488 Hurricanes in this. I don't believe what I'm saying, so boom. You get me? Let's just do it. Let's just see what they're talking about. Listen, like I said, Sam got Sam, I'll just squeeze his arm. No more excuses, no more weather this, tires this. Got to go to the dealership for this. I said, Sam, get the car out. He's like, all right then, Mike, f it. So, just got to your respect. He's pulling it out today. Yeah, gonna go for a little tickle in that. You never know as I'm not asking this, but fingers crossed he might even let me have a drive. And that's something I've never driven before. Get a little tickle in that. And then we'll put these side by side and do a few runs in that and see how quick this thing really is. You get me people? Peace. Yo, DMO. Eventually, bro, man might be in one of these soon as well, bro. And then me and you will be having it up. 016 and 0121. Pair of us in the SP shutting it down, you get me? Come on. Get out. Not too bad actually, it was alright. <laughs> Yes, people, Michael Shoeblacker. So like I say to him, I managed to twist his arm. He's brought out the new car. He's come to show it us. But I'm not going to lie. He's fucking took the bus. I'm not happy. Look at what he's come out in, people. All right, boys. <laughs> the guy, what is it? A fucking high on that I-10? Yeah, yeah. 2010, Reg. We've got it in, uh, we've got it in blue. We, what, what are they? Blue, this. Bayside blue, yeah? Blue. Fastest color. He's got Continentals on it, though. He's not, he's not scrimping on the tires. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, you know, inside they're actually 11s, but it's just the facer on it that makes it look blue. <laughs> <laughs> the tyres are like three inches thick alone. 
But nah, man, yeah. I wanted to get out for a little drive in this, but you know what? I'd probably rather get the bus home, people, I'm not gonna lie. As well, to be fair, just traction issues. Bin it or anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already joking. Look at what he's come out in, people. Just want another lyric. Tell me, are you with it? Just the other day, I see Mr. Pun and Visit. Do you want another spirit? Grind it up and bill it. On a man can tweet it. Us man can live it. Say she's a freak in the bed, but she's a frigid. I don't need no guest list. I don't need a ticket. Top gear in the whip, whip, you gotta stick it. And make sure it's worth it if you lick it. Cause I don't wanna listen. Can you see the vision? So, 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 what we got here, Sam? Right, so. We've got the McLaren 570 GT. GT, not an GT, S. Not an S. What's so the, the difference? The S has got a plastic back here. Okay. It's a little bit stiffer. Okay. Uh, the GT has got panoramic roof, glass back like this. Nice. Uh, just all around a bit nicer looking car, to be honest. Okay. Same power. Which is? 570 brake. Claimed. But, claimed. but they always run a bit more. Yeah, I was going to say, it probably is. And this does so much. Yeah. Okay. So. Okay. Um, what made you get a McLaren? Just always wanted one. Simple as that. Always Fair. wanted one. Scratch the itch. Living the dream. What colour is this? Uh, moonstone white. Moonstone white. Okay. It looks like white. It's it's been Bro, this is dirty, but you know what, people? It shows that the car's being driven. It's not a garbage queen, is it? Do you know what I mean? Um, yeah, tires, what have we got? B0, is any good? B0, they're all right. I can't complain. Is that what you came with? Yeah, yeah. I came okay. with them. Mileage, what have you got on it? It's got about three and a half on it. And you've got it on? Three. Is it done 500 miles? Yeah. How long have you had it? About two months. 500 miles in two months. People, if I had this, 500 miles in the first day. It's quite a time, it? Yeah, very true. <laughs> this is the guy, oh, this is Michael Shoewhite out as well, people, if you don't remember. Well, Michael Shoewhite out part two. We've got two Michael Shoewhite we've got the cameraman. Yeah, a bit awkward that, anyway. So they're going to battle it out, aren't they, on the yeah. track day? Who's claiming Michael Shoewhite, yeah, people? Did. I'm messing up your video with my shitty car. No, oh, you've embarrassed me now. I was claiming it was mine. <laughs> we'll go over the spec. Yeah, defo. So you got carbon pack on the interior. So you get that little face around the media. You get those little bits on the uh, steering wheel and some paddles. And that's three and a half thousand pounds. Yeah. Okay, it's like a bit, it looks like an iPad, doesn't it? It does, yeah. Three and a half grand for that little bit of carbon. Yeah. That's what scares me about it. Stuff, really? Yeah. And then you've got them, which are three grand again, They're just nice. for carbon mirrors. Yeah. Three grand for the mirrors? Apparently. Wow. Okay. Someone, someone paid three grand for it. Well, yeah. No, I didn't. Then we've got Balan, a Bang and Oliverson sound system. B and O. B and O. B and O. Big man tune. Come on, for the, when you're banging the rhythms and you've got a shield in the passenger seat. <laughs> um, the brakes, what brakes are they? Are they steel or, or ceramics? Steels, yeah. Okay. Steels, two types of ceramics. And it, <laughs> ceramics aren't cheap anyway. No. So, it's what it is, man. I mean, how does it, you know what, you know me, people, I'm, yeah. I'm, I just want to get out in it. It stops well, we'll find out, won't we? Let's get out in it. Let's get out, let's hear it running. Let's Go on, there. give us the feel, let's hear it running, let's get Sports out in the road. Sports exhaust and that. Sports exhaust. Sports exhaust. Okay. No decats, nothing like that, I haven't touched it. Okay. I haven't fiddled with it. If, you, if you're watching McLaren, it's stock, right? <laughs> This is how you got it, yeah? Yeah. Right. Hey. Sorry, say that again. It's stock. It's stock. Yeah? <laughs> lovely, look at it. Look at that sound of that. Oh, lovely jubbly. <laughs> So you know, after hearing that, I mean, engine, what, so what, what, what are in these? Uh, it's 3.8 V8 twin turbo. 3.8 V8 twin turbo. Okay, can we have a look at it? Is there much to see uh, or? No, you can't really, actually. To be honest. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Open up now. Can have a look through here. Through the mesh, the honeycomb mesh. See a bit of heat shielding. See the top, the top, the top, the top. Plastic back, you can just pull it off. Right. With this, you can't do it. So the engine work, you've got to go to McLaren? Yeah. No. Peak. Okay. And then you've 
Oh wow. Uh, luggage space to fit one bag. Right, so this summer people, when we're um, yeah. on our way down to Nürburgring and that, we need a luggage car for some, don't we? Yeah, we do. Yeah. You've got, no, you got no chance in that. Nah. Yo, tell you one thing, I'll shout straight away. These supercars, if I'm ever gonna get to a point where I can afford one of these, Big Mac's gonna have to go on a diet. Getting out of this car, it's, out, it's, just, like, it's just like doing 30 sit ups. Do you know what I mean? You know, I'm gonna have abs for days if I have one of these. Abs for days, people. Yeah, like me. <laughs> like, you got that big son. Right, join us on the other side, peace. McLaren 570 GT, 570 bhp approximately, probably got more. Any idea on the torque figures? Uh, about 700 newtons. 700 bit. newton meters, rearable drive, isn't it? Yeah. Gearbox? Seven speed. Is it dual, dual clutch? Dual clutch, seven speed, yeah. Nice. Seven speed DCT. Naughty. Naughty. You might do that window up, you know, for sound. I do. Yeah. Right, we're good, aren't we? Yeah, we're good. to this car because it's amazing but technically what we're in now is McLaren's entry level car yeah. let's be real it's a 570 this is their base model car that yeah. they bring out in it and then they, they constantly tell I'm actually want like the 720s I like and like the 765s too quick ruthless too quick but yeah it's the cabin's lovely man I mean like Oh, it's not a B and O. It's a Bowers and Wilkins. No. Oh, yeah. Bowers and, Bowers and Wilkins. Not a B and O. So we've got the Bowers and Wilkins system. We've got, I like the interior. The, I mean, what, I don't. I don't want to cross it. It's white. It's like a beige, isn't it? Yeah, like the beige and black interior. If I spec it from factory, I wouldn't have chose that. If I'm on it, it's gone black. That would have gone black. Black on black. Yeah. Okay. But, you know, right car, right time. iPads there. Cockpit's nice. Look at it. Check Where this you? out, right? So, I think this was 190 grand from the factory. Check this out. Oh, look at that sat down. Like, oh, wow. It's, it's like a Sam, it's like one of the most Samsung Walkman phones, isn't it? Yeah, S2 or something. 190 grand. Yeah. Fully oh. specced. Awful. Wow. What do these buttons down here mean? So you've got, that's the active select button. So if you haven't got active and the car's just driving in, normal gearbox, cruising around, normal suspension, you put it in active, then you can access these switches. Okay. So true manual mode all the time. This is your hand on this side, so track sport normal. Then you got your engine, track sport normal. Okay. You can set it up exactly how you want. As soon as okay. you press that button, bang. Nice, nice, nice. Was that full throttle? Yeah. It's loading it up. <laughs> he's, got the te he's got the techers, he's got the techers. <laughs> Come on. We need to get some fuel first, don't we? Yeah. Right, let's get some fuel. Let's get some fuel. This is nice. This is real nice. Quite civilized as well when you're not moving it. To yeah. Be fair, like, probably more comfortable than my R3. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Like to drive. Okay. Today. If I put it in normal, right? It'd be good to. Um, this is a bit of a bad road if I'm honest. I'm actually quite excited to put it side by side against the RS3 soon and yeah. to see what the difference, what, how much of a difference there is. It, it, to, to just, to just I feel like, uh, especially in this weather, I feel like the RS3 is going to have the, 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 the takeoff, honestly. Yeah, obviously. But I, I want to know what point this really starts reading it back in, if, if it does. I mean, yeah. what, what do you think? I, once we're rolling, I think I think this will take off. But yeah. From most scenarios, I reckon you'll be off. You'll be off. Okay. Yeah. That, that's obviously a part of to the traction because of the weather. Yeah. On a hot summer's day, it'd be a completely different story. Exactly, yeah. Because they're, they're similar power levels, aren't they? Yeah. Really? That's about 610 ish, 700 yeah. newton meters. On box, you've got more. But yeah, but you've got the one, you've got weight. What is this weigh? 
No, I don't know what it weighs, but okay. it's, it's a carbon tub. Okay. So, not much. Carl, if we can work out, find out what this weighs and inside that in the video, mate, just as like a little text box, yeah. that would be great. I mean, I know my, my Yaris 3 is mid 15s, I think. I think about 15, yeah, about 15, about 50. So, I mean, this, this, this will weigh less than that, though. I would say it would, yeah. Yeah. McLaren got f***ed up starting that, yeah. Fucking yeah, regulations. Is that what it is, yeah? Oh, complimentary <laughs> McLaren mints. What's so special about them? Um... Uh, sleeping pills, then. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll taste the McLaren mint. I'll... Right, people. MSB mint review. Yeah, I'll compare it to the Smints and the Polos. One second. Right. So, initial impression of the mints. Mm. Quite minty, actually. Yeah, they are quite minty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm blocking those. <laughs> quite a nice mint, that. Um, out of 10 compared to so Polo, Polo's got about a 6, Smint's got about a 7, McLaren's probably in between about a 6.5. Yeah, I'd about, say. About 6.5. It's the kind of mint that makes you want to get your wallet out. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's why they give it you. <laughs> makes you want to get your wallet out. <laughs> yeah. So when you're in there and they give you a mint, you think, and they start trying to reel you yeah. in like you need tires, yeah. even though you don't, and you need new pads. Yeah. You, you think, oh, why not? Six months early. Yeah. Here's <laughs> some mints. Why not? Let's do it. Here's a mint. Where's the shell garage? Where is shell? Straight down, four minutes. Came way too far. Yeah, we yeah. Did. got a bit excited didn't we, on the main roads then. <laughs> so is that suspension right now is that like set to comfort or is it just? Is yeah, it... that's normal now. Right. But then uh, put it in track. It's... Does it stiffen right up? Yeah. Put it in track. Just on a bad road, so you can feel what it's like. You feel it just bounce around. Yeah. Fuck. Instantly. Oh, gotta get it back down. Yeah, get that strip. Has it got like, a nose lift or does it not need it? Yeah, it's got a lift. Get it up there. Just needed on something like this, isn't it? It's a steep one, that. Cafe vibe. Isn't it? Yeah, no. And how long will that stay up for before it goes back down? Uh, it's until you get to about. 40 or 50 mile an hour, it'll okay. go straight down. Automatically. Yeah. Right. Have you ever forgot to have you have you ever forgot to engage the nose lifting and gone over a bomb? I haven't yet. Oof. But that won't be cheap, will it? No. The way up's not so bad, mate. You are? The way up a speed bumps. Not so bad, the way down, mate. Is that the problem, yeah? Yeah. Right. The fall from grace. See yourself in the shop window. Yeah, like, oh, she looks nice. It's really good. I like it, man. I like it. People, man, you know these McLarens and that. There's something else, aren't they? Can't wait to get some fuel and get out and have a proper little drive in this now. My initial impressions is, yeah, it's f***ing bad. Where's the shell? A bit further down. Where's the Tesco there? Oh, even better. Momentum. Yeah, even better, cheaper, and better fuel. Do you know that people? Tesco momentum is actually better. Then it's not called V Power no more, is it? What do they call it now? Yeah. But Shell's like whatever. Yeah. Premium offering. Yeah. Tesco is actually one of the best out there now. Believe it or not. One of the best things I've noticed already about this car, people. Yeah, and just the supercar situation in general. Look at the door. Look at this. Look at the doors. Oh, look at that. Wow. Oh my god! Look at the doors, people. I mean, come on. Come on. What do you do for a living? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that, so, end of the night, you got the club, in the nightclub, little Sheila, you go, come on, darling, come get into the car. You have to open the door. It's a guarantee, in it. It's on, straight home, you know, come on, darling, come back to mine. It's a winner. Your car's been declined, mate. If anyone wants to subscribe <laughs> to my uh, Patreon, <laughs> fuel. Big Sam setting up an OnlyFans as well. We've seen how well Big Mike's doing off it, and he wants one as well, people. Yeah. You're having another mint there, mate. Having another mint, mate. They're really minty, these mints. They're lovely. Look at them. Oh, he. 
a McLaren mint. I feel like luxury. I feel like really. Do it yours, Beck. We tune cars. Okay. Make them fast. Any sort of any car or a certain what do you specialise in? Yeah, mainly European cars to be fair. We tune anything, we'll make anything quick, but mainly we do specialise in your Audis, BMWs, supercars, stuff like that. Nice, nice. So plans with the McLaren, talk to me. We're gonna go stage two on it in summer. Okay. We're gonna get some down pipes, um, send it to about 750 brake. See where we get to there. 750 brake. Yeah. And and this these can take that no problem, yeah? Yeah, yeah, all day. Okay, it's engine. Hybrids they'll do nine. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh wow. Engine can take it no no problem. Yeah, no issue at all. Oh wow. It's a really strong uh, really strong platform. So it's the same engine that they use across the entire It's not in the 720S and the Senna's and stuff like it's the four litre. Right. Okay. Very similar. Okay. It is very similar, but okay. it's slightly different. All right, mate. How you doing? That's the only thing with owning a supercar that I've noticed. Well, I've not noticed myself when I own a supercar, but I've seen it to Sam before off camera. What's it like? I bet you just get some funny looks and just like people hating and that. And he's just like, yeah, I can imagine it though. People trying to comment about the size of my um, tool, which <laughs> really upsets me, actually. Is it true though? Yeah, I feel like just getting it out. Let's <laughs> <laughs> get out and slap it across their face. Have a look at this, but then I'll be arrested. Then yeah. I'll take my car and he's driving it home. It's just a vicious circle, really. Nick, Nick for brandishing a dangerous weapon. <laughs> <laughs> Can't be doing that in time. I'll tell you what, mate. Oh, wow, I thought my car gets a few. Like when I'm driving down the road in my car, you know, people staring. The supercar, it's a complete different kettle of fish. People that don't have interest in cars double take and look at this. Did I've been in it for five minutes and it's crazy. When you start putting down pipes on this and you've got the sound to go with it, you know. He just ruins us. Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh, it's so ferocious in here. Yeah. Was that full throttle? About 75%. Oh my gosh, I don't think it, people listen. Uh, I don't know about the RSV might struggle against this, I'm not gonna lie. Especially from a roll. Yeah. From a roll, it's a completely different kettle of fish. From a standing start, I'm screwed, but. Yeah. Can you imagine this? Isn't Start, when you start modding this stage doing that, it's gonna be on it's gonna be scary. Yeah. It's gonna be scary quick. It is. It's gonna be too it's quick. It's the first stock car I've ever driven in for. Do you know what? This is actually really fast. Yeah. We drive fast shit all day every day. Yeah. So we actually got in this and thought they can't be that fast, it's the entry level one, but no. Yeah. before you sell it, bro. Bruv, oh my gosh. Bro, I'm, I'm big, oh bro, this is scary. This is scary quick, bro. This is fucking scary quick. Yo, this is, I saw my language, Carl, I know you're gonna have to edit it, and you're like, you swearing too much. <laughs> this is absolutely sick. 10 out of 10. I think the RS3's got a chance against this. On a roll. On a roll, not a chance. Not a fucking chance. But at the same time, though, I need to. I'm, I'm, I can't doubt my car because I've had it with R8s, 458s, yeah. Hurricanes, and I've been with them or I've ahead of them. Which, you know, yeah, you got to remember we're low down. And yeah, and that's the thing like, as well. There's a lot of drama. Yeah. We're, we're sat very close. Bro, people, I'm sat on the floor. I, I, every time I lean forward, it feels like I'm doing a setup. <laughs> do, you know, do, you know, do you know what I mean? So. There's the sense of speeds a lot, yeah, but it's quick.
this. <laughs> this is fucking ferocious, people. This is. They got pro vinyl in there. Everybody missed them. to go and see Sam quickly now and um, just work out the plan for the rest of this video because we started filming the McLaren the other day as you know but weather wasn't on our side and a, a, a 600 -ish bhp McLaren rear wheel drive in the wet bit of a no-no so we're gonna go and meet up with him now work out the plan for this evening um do that and then we're going to get the main girl cleaned because she's a bit of a dirty one at the minute and we really like a dirty girl but I don't like my car's dirty um, so we're going to get that done and then it's probably chill out until a little bit later on when we catch our flight over to Mexico and we can really finally get to see how fast this car is free is because I see time and time and time again I know how fast this car is but putting it, translating that on camera sometimes and on screen is a very difficult thing and we all know what McLarens are like so let's put this up against the McLaren and gauge how quick this car actually is people you get me? and I'm telling you now is it gonna is it gonna be in for a bit of a surprise? I think personally. I know my car. And I've had it with plenty of cars and I know my car. And Sam's 570 GT is a quick car. You see Sheila right here? <laughs> Yo, man's getting these poses on point nowadays. Next thing you're gonna catch one on the catwalks and on the billboards and that big mic 0161's number one model. You get me? But yo, people, you join us a few days later to the continuation of the 570 GT video. Storm Eugene took control the other day and it was a washout. So we had to pack up, go home, and save it for a rainy day. We didn't want a rainy day, we wanted a dry day. And today, we got a dry evening. So we're sat outside your respect now. The time is 2700 hours on the 15th of Jalemba and we're out here. He's just going to get some fuel. We're going to go for a little drive in the GT and then put it up against the main squeeze. And you'll see how quick the RS3 really is. My predictions, RS3 for the win. Cameraman's predictions? RS3. Okay. But listen, oh. Oh, oh I don't know if the camera can pick that up. But he's coming. It's got to be him, ain't it? So, oh. It's a ghost town around here. Bloody ghost town. Big up your respect here. Yeah. Big up Sam. Big up the cameraman each and every time. Big up the subscribers. Listen, if you haven't already as well, actually, while I'm sat here chilling and talking. Talking. I'll, oh, we'll come back to that. We'll come back to that. Here we <laughs> He's got someone in the P as well, so it's a level playing field. It's two versus two. You get me? Oi, oi. But yo, people, listen to it. But you can't, you can't, you can't f with him, can you? Look, listen to that. <laughs> Naughty. Naughty. Yeah. 
Nice car, but fuck off. <laughs> this is four man deep as well, yeah? yeah. Just gonna go out for a little midnight cruise in the midnight run. Do you remember that game Midnight Club back in the day? Would you like a McLaren Mint, Mr. Cameron? A McLaren Mint? Yeah. Oh my yeah, What's this? A on these the is day. this like that film Limitless? Is it just yeah, gonna yeah. make me own a McLaren? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, that's why I meet loads of what's up so far. <laughs> How are you, mate? It's been lovely. So yes, people. Um, like I've seen before. We were out in this for a week, the other day I should say, the other week, and um, the storm decided to have other ideas and we got rained out, so we thought we'll continue it tonight. A um, few runs beside the RS3 and just, I don't know, just nice. Nice. Just nice. Nice. Oh, that was nice. One thing I did notice on the motor with me in the first pull. Um, this is so much more instant. Yeah. And this, is, this, is, this is a turbo charge, isn't it? Yeah, it's been turbo, yeah. 4 litre, or 3.8. 3.8, you got it. V8, twin turbo, yeah. But they are quite old turbos, old turbo technology, so they are a bit lazy, so once you have to keep it, I'm working quite hard to keep it in that power band okay. ready to launch off with you. Like, okay. if I didn't, you'd be absolutely gone. Okay, gold. okay. So, I need to tune it. It's it to yes. basically be a no end or that.
mistreating us today, people. Contain yeah. myself? No, nah, not a f Sick. We need to like a supercar. The next bracket, it's just like off the shelf as well. Like you know, that's been tuned and tuned and tuned. Like this is stock, man. And it's just like it's, it's mental, isn't it? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, mad. So we're gonna take a little drive into the city centre now. You know, in the McLaren and the RS3. <laughs> so you know, okay, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
going home. <laughs> I thought I was going to do a wheelie. Oh my days. Four wheels were spinning then. Oh my days, bro. <laughs> bro. What? All the wheels started spinning. It's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Fucking animal, mate. It keeps on losing traction. Okay. I keep losing traction. Yeah, I see. I don't <laughs> <laughs> this thing is a beast now, bro. People! So, I mean, this thing is a fucking rocket ship. Big 570 GTs and that. Getting handy Gappuccinos. Left in Gappy stand. You get me beside a Gappy bread. <laughs> the Gappy meals. The Gappy meals. Just me. <laughs> Yo! It's just stepping! It's just spinning Yeah, chilling! Chilling! Oh one six one whip up. Top one, I ain't no capper. I'm a jammer. Big whips like Stu Michael. But you know, man's got melanin, so they call my Michael Stu Black. Slightly, I do the dash, that's minor. 0161 driver. Swear down, nobody can't test, man. Road our trap, man, we can do either. When them man do talk and we do talk, we mean it different.